as a field service engineer, travel is a big part of the job. In this video, I'll discuss some of the per diems you'll have access to relating to travel, food, and vehicle that makes the job a little bit better. Welcome back to Untitled Label, where we strive for greatness through optimization. I'm John, I'm a field service engineer, and on this channel, I strive to share my life on and off the clock with you. If this is your first time on the channel, welcome, and I hope you get some value out of the videos and content that I have to offer. If you are a current subscriber, welcome back, and as always, thank you so much for your support. If you enjoy this video at the end, or even right now, consider smashing that thumbs up button as it helps YouTube algorithm share this video with other people that may be interested as well. With the introduction out of the way, let's get into today's video. The first aspect of per diems I'll cover is more so related to travel. Uh, this might not be a necessarily in a cash value. However, it does equate to a points value if you are using a common airline, a common rental company, or a common hotel chain. The company that I work for, my current employer, allows me to keep points based on these previous things that I've mentioned. Uh, one other thing I also do is use my own personal credit card in order to earn more points in the same manner. For me, I like to fly with United as well as Enterprise and Marriott hotel chains. Let me know in the comments below what you prefer as far as your airline, your go-to rental company, and your go-to hotel chain. When it comes to booking travel outside of your general area or your city that you live in, um, these travel plans, if you are able to create them yourself, are going to be very advantageous to earning points. Over time, these points do add up and they can equate to either free stays, free flights, or free rentals in the long run. The benefit as well to choosing one particular airline is over time, you will have access to free checkbacks. Um, so you can get around having to pay a checkback fee or any kind of airline fee for changing your flight if you show that loyalty to that same airline. The same thing can be said for hotels. You might be able to get upgrades um, to better rooms and occasionally free gifts or free points upon checking into a hotel. When it comes to the points aspect of travel, this is extremely useful because up to the point where I get a lot of free upgrades when it comes to my airline. Um, flying often, I earn a lot of mileage, uh, lots of points through my airline that I use. Again, that's going to be united for me. So occasionally I'll get free upgrades due to my loyalty. Another aspect of per diem is going to be your food allowance. When you're away from your local area, uh, from my employer, they do offer a daily food allowance. This allows me to eat breakfast, lunch, as well as dinner. Uh, this is set to a certain amount, which we try to stay under for the day. However, this is a great way for you to kind of lower your expense as you're not having to pay for food when you're not in your home area. Another per diem that pertains to being a field service engineer is tied to your vehicle. For me, I actually have a vehicle allowance that I get each paycheck to compensate for me using my own vehicle. Now, some employers actually will give uh, their employees a vehicle to use. Uh, shout out to my good friend and veteran, Josh Brown, who is a field service engineer in a different industry. His company actually gave him a car to use for his travel purposes when he's driving around town or driving to somewhere not too far away. Tying in with this is also your gas expense. Usually if I'm driving far enough or throughout the week to go to customer sites, I'm able to save my receipts that I've spent on gas and I can get reimbursed for my gas payments. Lastly, now this might not be offered to every employee or every company. However, for extended trips where I'm staying a little bit longer to help out in the area, um, I do get a extended stay kind of per diem bonus. This isn't something that's usually offered to everyone. However, I do appreciate my employer for offering this as it is a token of appreciation. Uh, usually this can range from about a hundred bucks or so. And this allows me to go out in town, enjoy the town, usually because I'm staying through the weekend. So I can go out, enjoy the city that I'm in and do some extracurricular activities. A lot of times I'll use this to either visit museums or art galleries as that is something that I am interested in. 
If you are a current field service engineer and your company offers other types of per diem, let me know in the comments below as I'm sure different companies offer different types of per diem as well. If you've enjoyed this video and you haven't subscribed yet, smash that subscribe button as well as the thumbs up button as it helps other people discover this video. With that said, I'll catch you on the next one.